morning everybody welcome back to my channel and to another video today's going to be a really fun day so i thought i would bring you guys along with me but before we get started thank you to better help for sponsoring today's video better help is the world's largest therapy service and it's 100 percent online as you guys know i've gone through a lot of seasonal affective disorder and I also just, you know, sometimes you go through a hard time in your life and seeing a therapist is something that is so helpful because you're getting an outside perspective. And it's something that I've learned over the years that is really beneficial to me and something that I definitely want to implement into my life and <laughs> something that I think is amazing for everyone. I think everyone really could benefit from speaking to a therapist. With BetterHelp, you can tap into a network of 30,000 licensed and professional therapists who can help you with a wide range of issues. To get started, you just answer a couple questions about the therapy services that you would need so that BetterHelp can match you with a therapist that is right for you. Then you're able to talk to a therapist however you feel comfortable, whether that's in text message, whether that's in video calls, whether that's in phone calls, you get to pick what kind of service works the best for you. You can message your therapist at any time and schedule live sessions when it works best for you. If the therapist isn't a right fit for you, you can always switch to a new one for no additional charge. With BetterHelp, you get the same professionalism that you would get in an in-office therapist, but instead you have all the accessibility of being able to tailor when you talk and how you talk. You get a therapist who is custom picked for you, you get flexibility in your schedule, and you get it at a more affordable price. You can get 10% off your first month at betterhelp.com backslash Chelsea T. That's better H E L P dot com backslash Chelsea T to get started. I've also linked them down below in the description. Yes, thank you to BetterHelp for sponsoring today's video. I definitely will be using this service. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna be heading to an event right now or very soon with Kiehl's, which I'm very excited about. It's for Pride Month and I can't wait to go. I think we're gonna be doing like an art session together because they had an artist come in to design their Pride Month like special packaging and we're gonna be doing art with them, which I'm really excited about. I feel like it's gonna be such a good time. This is my outfit. I came back from F45 and just glammed myself up. Also, if you watched my last video, my curls are still looking cute. This is second day. This is why I love using an actual iron, because I'm like, the curls just last so much better. But let me show you guys my outfit. So I'm just wearing jeans. These are Levi's ribcage jeans in this nice light wash. Button up is one of my favorites. It is from Aritzia. And then this little silky tank top is from Zara. And then I'm going to carry this cute Ella bag, because it's brown and it matches my, my outfit. We're looking cute. We are looking cute. But yeah, I'm very happy to have you all here. It's gonna be a good time. And I'll see y'all when we get to the Kiehl's event. And just hope it doesn't rain on me because the weather is looking fashionable today. edition for us um, using some iconography that he will explain very shortly. We're super excited to work with uh, John on this amazing partnership and see this all come to life. I just got back from the Kiehl's event. It was so much fun. I knew like a couple girls there so it was just a good time. Loved it. Loved the team from Middle Child and we made like little artworks that are basically inspired by their pride collection so if you buy one of these twenty dollars of the proceeds go to like a lgbtq charity basically so definitely check this out but how cute <laughs> i just think it's so funny i'm like yeah just a my little doodle i love it they also gave us some chocolates as well which are always a nice treat but i right now i'm actually gonna just oh that was loud I'm gonna do some editing. I have a lot of editing to do. So I'm gonna sit down and work on that video for a couple hours and then I'll check in with you guys and see how y'all are doing. We gotta pick out our outfit to wear tonight to the dinner. I'm really excited. It's with Tower 28 and I'm just pumped. So I need to figure out what I'm gonna wear. Okay, I finished my editing for today. So now I'm gonna try and pick what dress to wear for my dinner tonight. I think I'm gonna wear a dress. 
I could wear a little blazer outfit though that I have, which would look really cute. Wait, hold on. I have another outfit that I haven't worn, like the little matching set, which would be adorable. Guys, should I wear this? It's like a little suit jacket with like a matching mini skirt. This would be really cute. Business gal, I don't know, this could be an option. I don't know if that's like summery enough for me. Like I feel like, you know, it's like summer vibes and I feel like I should wear a dress. Ooh, I have this dress. Do you think this gives dinner vibes? I have had this dress for a bit now and I love it and I haven't worn it. Like this with like little black heels, I think would be so cute. It's from Zara. I just don't know if it's like giving dinner. It is black, so it's kind of giving dinner, I feel like. I don't know, I love that one. So that's an option. Hmm. Too many options, too little time. I have a ton of like summery girly dresses. I just don't know if they're like a dinner vibe. You know, this is my, this is my current thing. Like I feel like they're like a, a daytime vibe, lunch vibe, but are they a dinner vibe? I have this dress, which I love. I, last time I wore this was in France and it's like one of my favorites. It's this like maxi style dress from Verge Girl and it's in this really pretty hat. Like it's just beautiful. It's beautiful. This could be really nice. I feel like I wanna like try on these options and see which one we're vibing with. I, I wanted it to give dinner vibes though. Like I feel like bright and colorful, like all my bright and colorful dresses are just very daytime. Like I don't feel like any of them are, are having a nighttime vibe, which is my issue with them. Ooh, I have this though. I haven't worn this dress in so long. This could be really pretty. <gasps> I'm thinking I might wear this. Guys, look at this dress. I haven't worn this since 2019 and it's beautiful. Okay, I feel like this might be the vibe. Because this is so pretty. Is it too much? Can it be too much? I feel like no. I feel like there is no limit to what you can wear. Like I would just wear not very high heels. Let me try it on, let me try it on. This is option one. Love this dress so much, so pretty. Very like, just beautiful. I love all the different patterns on it, all the different like cuts and frills and bows. I just think this is such a pretty dress. So maybe, I don't know, I do really like it. Is it too much? Can it be too much? You know, you can never be overdressed, I feel like. <laughs> the only thing is this one is a little tight in the, just in here. So sitting and like eating in this might be a little bit annoying. Okay, here's option number two with the little black and white floral dress, super cute. It has pockets, which you never complain about. The only thing that's annoying about these straps is they're not actually tie-up straps. Like they're like, sewn together. I want to see if I can like cut them apart. Um, I think they're just sewn together. So hopefully I could cut them apart and then tie them myself because they're a little bit long on me. I feel like I need to tie them, but this dress is super cute. I don't know. Oh my God, I'm like falling over. <laughs> then we have this dress, which you guys already know that I love. This is like one of my favorite dresses. I think I'm going to wear this. I don't know, it's like sexy, <laughs> but like cute and effortless, super comfortable. Like the material is really stretchy. I'm just gonna put nude underwear on because you can kind of see the outline of my underwear. But other than that, this is like one of my favorite dresses to wear. It's just so comfy. And yeah, like literally just an effortless looking dress. I love this. So I'm thinking maybe this. We'll try on the last option. Okay, and then this is the last, last option. I don't think I like this one as much. Obviously, you just have like the little blazer and skirt. I don't know, it's cute, but I kind of just like the dresses. I don't know. This is cute though, but I don't know. The dresses is kind of giving me more life.
morning everybody it is the next day the tower 28 event was so nice so it is it was for the launch of their new product this is it it's going to be coming out pretty soon it's already on sephora but it says coming soon so this is their sos um daily barrier recovery cream so that kind of like goes along with their sos toner so these are great if you have any sort of troubled skin acne eczema etc etc these would be great for you but yeah I'm really excited to try this out. I'm like gonna finish up the moisturizer that I'm using right now and then I'm going to switch to this one and see how I like it. They also just sent over, they also just gifted us the Make Waves mascara, which is my favorite mascara of all time. And just some lip products. I was actually wearing this right now. This is the Tinted Lip Balm in Shake. It's so nice, like. This is gonna be in my purse. And then also just the lip gloss in the shade Sesame. Yeah, that was such a nice event. I literally got to meet the CEO, Amy, and she was the sweetest person, so nice. I get like really nervous when I'm meeting people that are like high up in brands. So I literally did that thing where like you go in, they go in for a hug, you go in for a handshake, then they switch to a handshake, and then you go in for a hug and you do this like awkward dance. And I was like, I am so embarrassed right now. I'm so sorry. And she was like, no, no worries. Like, I was so embarrassed and why am I like that? I am so awkward. But um, it was just so nice to meet her. She was so sweet and nice and like down to earth. And I was just so honored to be chosen to be invited to this event. I was like, oh, cause it's one of my like favorite clean beauty brands. Like I love Tower 28. So anyways, so much fun. Um, and I just can't believe that I got invited to that. I'm about to eat it. I'm just gonna eat a banana right now. I wanted to go for, like I should go for my run, but I just don't think I'm going to. I honestly have really low energy right now. And um, I'm just gonna listen to my body and we're not gonna, we're not gonna run today. I'm thinking about though, packing an outfit to run tomorrow. So, we'll see. <laughs> this is good. But anyways, you guys can help me pack. I'm gonna pack up for my little weekend away. You guys can help me out. Skincare bag, my hair and makeup bag, and my book. Going in here, <laughs> I need to pick out what clothes to wear. It's not gonna be that warm tomorrow. So I'm not gonna bring like super summer clothes. I think it's gonna be 18 and sunny. So not that warm. This is my current outfit. I didn't even show you guys. I'm just wearing this knit sweater with these shorts and I'm gonna wear my Birkenstock clogs with it. Just like comfy. I also have like the worst blisters on my feet from my shoes I wore last night. So I just wanted to wear something comfy. Like me carrying my water bottle like a child. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna pick out some outfits and pajamas. Where's mommy going? I also have this big pile of clothes I need to like sort out. My, my life is just a mess right now. Like look at, <laughs> it's just everywhere is a disaster and it's overwhelming me, but what can you do? Outfits, round two. Pajamas, I'm gonna bring this pair because they're my favorite. They're so comfy. They're from, what is the brand called again? Cozy Earth, they are the softest pajamas. I think they're made of like bamboo fiber or something. I don't know, but they are like the comfiest pajamas of all time. So these are coming with me because comfort is key. And then what does one wear when it's not that warm out? Questions of the day. Um, I'm thinking about bringing just this long sleeve. I'll just wear these shorts. Oh my God, this long sleeve has like a little, I kind of already knew that this had a mark on it. It's from my dryer, which is really annoying. Maybe not then. Can you see me getting overwhelmed? I'm like, ugh, what the hell do I wear? The struggle is real, guys. The struggle is real. I don't know. I think I'm gonna have to resort to Pinterest. I need to look up some Pinterest stuff. Okay, I literally <laughs> packed a ridiculous amount of clothes for just a two night stay, but I don't know the vibe. I don't know what's going on at this hotel that I'm going to with my mom. So I have like a nice casual, but nice dinner outfit that I can wear if I want to, pajamas, and then some casual options for the following days. So <laughs> that was the vibe of what I packed. And those are my like nicer sandals for, but they're still flat, you know, comfy, cute, cash. And the current vibe, because my feet are like repairing right now from <laughs> the stress that I've put them through. So 
comfy casual vibe it is all right guys i'm going to end off today's video here i hope that you guys enjoyed it give it a thumbs up if you did subscribe if you're new and stay tuned for my next one bye <laughs>